Hello friends, today I'm going to show you three knots or bands and uh, <laughs> the first one is the Zeppelin one. I do it like this. I first make a little thing like this and then this is pointing that way and then I put it in here and go over here and put it back over. It's two overhand knots intertwined. And this is very good because when you shake it, it doesn't go up. That's why they call it Zeppelin knot because they tie down the Zeppelin thing, you know. A boat losing the rope, it drifts away and you can rule. But it's a plane, you know, it flies away. It's kind of hard to get him back. So that's one knot. That's the good thing with that. And then we got the Carrick Band. It's a very good one. I do it like this way. I put a thing like that. And then I put it up under here. And then I pull it up a little bit here. And through here, I put this one. And then it looks very nice and thick like that. But when you do it like this, it collapses like this. Good thing about this knot is it's got the biggest ear of any knot I do. Ear, I mean, like when you want to bring it back, this is like a good ear. So even if I hang the boot on it, this is to get up. And the third one is uh, what the climbers call the European death knot. If you just want to tie two, knot, two ropes together, you just like this and not like that. But then to make it even more sure you do one again. And then it kind of looks nice, you know. And then you put it like this. And I think it's also good for shaking, but you must be careful with it. And it can slide on a thing like this. It doesn't usually get caught there. And this is just a few knots, but all knots use this, the capstan equation. The load, what you're pulling on, or, or the load, what's one end. But if you put it around, it's E, E is the Euler number, 2.7 something. It's irrational and it's maybe even transcendental number. And this mu is the friction coefficient. And uh, what is, this is Greek, P maybe. It's the angle in radians, how you turn it around. And it's also with squeeze. But it's a really neat, exponential function so if you take one turn around maybe it's just a tenth of the force two times one hundred three times a thousand so it's a very good equation to keep in mind when you're handing ropes so thank you for today hello friends this is what i made my notes in on a little small paper a6 and now I order paper, I asked them to cut them in four pieces. They didn't do that, but then, thanks to the bandsaw, I cut them there. And it worked very well, you know. You see how fine it is. So, this is just a little bonus, a good idea. If you want to save the world, you know, not using so much paper, be careful. Thank you for this.